Hi, welcome to this Glogster EDU tutorial. Uh, in this case, you are watching how to set up your Glogster classroom. If you haven't registered for an account, you need to go ahead and do that step first. Um, if you need help with that, you can watch the video how to register for your account. Um, this video begins once you're already on your dashboard. As you can see, we're on my dashboard. And this dashboard, I'm going to click it just so you can see what it should look like right when you come up. And I haven't done anything. I haven't edited my profile. I haven't added any students. Um, all I've done is registered for my account. The first thing I'm going to do is add students. To add students, I scroll down and I click on Add New Students. It's going to ask how many students I want for my class. In the basic version, you're allowed 100 unused accounts. Um, so you can you know, choose 50, choose 75. Um, I go ahead and choose all 100 so that I have access to all of them as needed. Once you fill in the number, you click Add Accounts. And the accounts will be generated. This takes a few minutes. I see a mes message that students were successfully added. And then I scroll down and I see in Glogster EDU messages that I have a message about sub-accounts for my nicknames. So I click here. You'll never want to delete this. You want to make sure that you keep track of it. And here I see my generated students' accounts. And it has a nickname and password and first login link for each student. And it's, I can scroll down and see all 100 are there. So I would suggest keeping this message, never deleting it, um, and having the information readily available to you. From here, there are a lot of different ways that you can give these accounts out to your students, um, and there are other instructions available for how to assign student accounts. This is the end of this tutorial. If you want to, you can watch how to assign student accounts, and I will give you an example for how I have used uh, a method to assign accounts to each of my students. Thank you for watching.